I grew up thinking it would be easy figuring out my life's journey, as if doors would just open for me. University, a job, a family, a happy life. However, I'm in my 20s and starting to realize that it's not so simple. This is where Odyssey plans can really help. What would my future life look like if I went through this door instead of that one? Bill Burnett and Dave Evans designed an Odyssey plan template to help us identify key milestones in the next five years of our lives. We're going to look at three different scenarios and take a look at what our future might hold. Our first possible future is what we see ourselves doing in the next five years if everything goes to plan. In my plan, I would like to build on my experience of doing environmental work with the European Solidarity Corps. Perhaps in the first year, I'll start an internship at the Botanical Garden and learn more about Slovenia's ecosystem. Next year, I could start a job in the flower industry to gain more experience and money, draft my own business plan in the third year, investigate loans for small businesses in the fourth, and towards the end of the fifth, I might be close to opening my own flower shop. However, things rarely go perfectly to plan. In my case, maybe working with plants just isn't my thing. This leads us to the second Odyssey plan, the scenario in which something has changed and our first plan is no longer an option. Maybe I want to stay connected to the European Solidarity Corps from a people point of view. I could look for jobs with a local hosting organization this year and begin a career working to make sure more young people get the opportunity to live and work abroad. Who knows, maybe in five years I'll be working for an European institution on policies that directly affected people like myself. In the final scenario, we're going to think about what would we do if money was no longer an issue. In this life, perhaps I want to go back to volunteering. I could become an environmental activist, maybe try my hand at writing an eco-friendly travel blog for young people. Now that we have our three different plans, we must assess the following. Do we possess the resources to make this happen? How confident are we that this can happen? Does the plan truly match what we want to do? How enthusiastic are we about it? Finally, we're going to give each plan a name, like the flower plan, the youth career plan and the eco blogger plan, and write down questions we have for each one. For instance, if I want to start my own business, can I afford to take holidays the year before? There are infinite choices in life, and perhaps none of your plans will fully come to fruition. But the whole point is to be prepared and know that you have options for when life puts an obstacle in your path.